What's happening, people? So this is a one-month update of me consistently using minoxidil since July 30th, 2024. So as you can see, um, since the last video that I put out, go check out the last video, there hasn't been that much growth since. Honestly, ever since I started growing it out, I haven't really had great results. Shout out to Austin Dunham. He's the person that put me on to minoxidil. I looked at his three-month minoxidil growth video when he first started using it, and the man had a light stubble. He basically had a full-on light stubble, and it was crazy. Like, he makes it seem like minoxidil is the truth, minoxidil is the answer. You use it, and you will have an automatic beard, no doubt about it. But the truth of the matter is, it doesn't seem like it works the same way for everybody. Uh, some people are slow growers. I've heard that it takes it could take up to two years to actually see good progress with minoxidil growth. My plan, I started using minoxidil on my face for my beard this the first weekend of December of 2023, and I plan on continuing to do that until 2025. So I'm just gonna show you guys the progress right now. You can't really see it that well over here, but like to be honest with you, I'm getting somewhere, in my opinion. I've had friends tell me that I've had good progress from like when I first started because I used to not have jack squat, no hair on my face whatsoever. And since then they say they've seen a lot of growth, but I'm not gonna lie to you, I'm a little unsatisfied with my progress. I used it every single day with derma rolling twice a week and I thought that I was gonna have better results just from being laser focused and laser consistent. But the true fact of the matter is, that is not how it's gonna be. It takes time. And uh, using this minoxidil as a process to grow my beard is going to be a true testament to my long-term mindset. And that is one thing that I recommend to anybody that starts minoxidil that they should always have. Now they may ha have great results after like two months. For me, it's been nine and this is really pretty much all I have and I bet a lot of people will quit you hear what I said you probably quit at this point it's been nine months since I've started using minoxidil and this is all I have with derma rolling as well it's tough man it's not an easy process gotta use it consistently every morning and every night you know, skipping a day is okay, but try make sure you don't skip two. Gotta build the habit of using minoxidil every morning and every night. You can do it right when you wake up, you can do it right before you leave for school, for work, whatever you need to go to, and then right before you go to bed. Using it consistently has taught me discipline and setting a goal for myself. My next goal for myself, honestly, is to hopefully have somewhat of growth all around here by the first weekend of December of 2024. That will be the that will mark a full year of me using minoxidil, uh, or since I started using minoxidil. Now, in terms of my eyebrows, I did show you guys what I was using. Using it was a it was sort of not rapid brow, but it was like a simple brow serum that helped my eyebrow growth. I actually like what it's done for my eyebrows. It's I've had a lot of growth since, especially since minoxidil was kind of, I used the minoxidil topical solution instead of the foam for my eyebrows, and it wasn't necessarily working too good for it. Um, I would go through the shedding phase, but it didn't really seem like I would get much grow back at all. So my plan is with the brow serum that I do have, if you wanna know what that looks like, go check out my last video on minoxidil. It ran out. The direction said to use it once a day and it was supposed to last about six months. I used it twice a day, every single day, and it lasted me about a month and a half. So fortunately I'm out of that. But now is the time where I need to go ahead and start using Rapid Brow, which is what was recommended by Phoenix Fearless for eyebrow growth as well. So like I said, guys, I was gonna update you guys on the progress. It's looking all right. I wish I could be more content with it, but I have this little stash that looks like if it grows in, it's going to get ugly, but I'm trying my best, man. We got looks, max, and goals to accomplish. Hopefully by next year, maybe the start of 2025, we're going to see some real progress. Anyways, that's the video for today. Please leave a comment if you have any questions. Um, I'll, have, I'll be happy to answer anything, honestly. 
Um, I'm still going to keep making these videos. I think my next progress video will be in December. So just be on the lookout for that. So I'll be out. Peace and love.